Welcome back, family members. Welcome back, little ones. Welcome back all. God, you all can make it back today for story number 64, A New World. God is our Heavenly Father. He created us all. He created any and everything and everyone that you see. He created us all. And uh, don't forget to tell your loved ones that you love them. I love you all with the love of the Lord. With that being said, let's get right to the story. Story number 64, A New World. One day, I will come back. We will all be together again, Jesus told his special friends before he went home to God. That was a promise for all his friends. That includes us. One day, someday. Now John was on prison island. The friends of Jesus were in trouble. Trouble, trouble, will it ever end? Why doesn't Jesus come back, they said. But God knew all about their trouble. He sent one of his angels to John. Come with me, the angel said. I have something to show you. What he saw was so exciting. John wrote at once to all the friends of Jesus. It's going to be all right, John said. God is making everything new again. He's shown me his wonderful new world. One day, someday, we will all share it. God will wipe away all our tears. No one will die anymore. No one will be hurt. I saw a beautiful, shining city, the city where God is. It's never dark in that city. It shines all the time with God's light. Nothing that's nasty or bad can ever come there. But God's friends can go in and out and enjoy it forever. God and his people together, as Jesus promised, just as it was when the world began. The end. Wow, what a beautiful story. And that is true. That's what's going to happen. God is looking for us to be his disciples. Because we're good friends of Jesus. And we're supposed to tell others about God and tell them to preach the gospel of the kingdom, the gospel of Christ. And we're supposed to tell everybody, teach them love, because God is love. Our Heavenly Father is love. And we want to live like Jesus and live a life of holiness. You're supposed to start at your young age to be obedient to your parents. You must listen to what they tell you to do. You know, God is over us all, but... Your parents are the ones that care for you. So make sure you be good boys and girls and listen to your parents and do what's right. And when you have friends or their friends that want to get in trouble, please don't follow them. Be like Jesus and be a good soldier for Christ. Well, with that being said, God's willing, we'll come back tomorrow for another story. I'll be getting a new book altogether. But, um... And also, there's a new song I made up that I want to teach you guys also. Anyway, you guys have yourself a blessed day. I love you all. Little ones, you have a blessed day as well. And tell your loved ones, each and every one of you, make sure you tell your loved ones that you love them. Because we're not promised tomorrow. We live each day as another glorious day that the Lord has made. Well, with that being said, you all have a blessed day. I love you all, the love of the Lord. God bless you. Bye-bye.